Alexa Developer Console makes it easy to build and manage your Alexa skills across the entire skill building journey. Before you can start building, you'll need to name your skill. To walk you through each step, we'll create a custom skill, Pet Match. We've reorganized the console into four steps. Build, test, launch, measure. First, you'll work on building an interaction model. Create an invocation name that's unique and natural. Remember that your users will need to say this while interacting with your Alexa skill. So when you design your voice user interface, think about how your invocation name will fit into the sentence a user will say. Now spend time defining the things your skill will do, in tense, and how your users will ask your skill to do them, utterances. You can now define custom slots easily right here inside the console. Slots allow you to accept input from users. If your skill will play video or stream music, you'll want to enable those services under Interfaces here. For those who prefer code, the JSON editor is at your disposal. Now specify an endpoint where your code will live. Alexa will look here to find the answer, information, step, or dice roll the user needs. Remember, your endpoint is not your interaction model, it's where your custom logic will live. Ready to launch? First, give your skill a try. Use your voice or type to interact with Alexa and ensure that your skill works the way you designed it to. Not working as expected? Dig into the JSON to see exactly what Alexa is sending and receiving from your endpoint. The new testing simulator supports entity resolution. The synonyms that you've mapped to your custom slot values will now appear in the JSON request. It also supports dialog management. When everything works as expected, you're ready to launch. Describe your skill and provide example phrases so that users know how to get started interacting with it. Take the time to get these right by looking through the on-screen reference material so that your skill will pass certification. More details are available here. When you've passed certification and people are using your skill, you'll want to dig into some metrics. From here, you can keep track of sessions, discover your most popular intents, and formulate insights into what is and isn't engaging your users. It's a good idea to build something simple from scratch in the new console to get used to it. So get started today. Build, test, launch, and measure.